I'm gonna show you how Google Lens will upgrade your workday. Copy text from the real world, send. Oh, I got some loud uh, construction. I wanna move locations real quick. Copy text from the real world and then send that text to any of your computers. Quickly look up new concepts. Grab editable text from baked in images and PDFs. Scan address details and add it to your calendar as an event. You can even translate any language that you see in the real world so you can understand it. There's a whole bunch of productive use cases for Google Lens. Come with me as we discover them. tucked away in a corner of San Diego's Balboa Park. It's really cool. Google Lens gives superpowers to the camera on your phone. It's not for recording content, but it is for understanding the world around you and digitizing it. This can really speed up a lot of workflows that you encounter throughout your workday. On Android, Google Lens is a dedicated app, and for iPhones, Google Lens is integrated into the official Google iOS app. Google Lens can even read your handwritten notes, but it has to be written neatly. So if you have good penmanship, then Google Lens will be great for scanning and digitizing your notes. With Google Lens, you can also quickly learn new concepts that you're reading about, tap on any text that you're scanning, and you can get a definition right there. Easy peasy. Easy peasy. Do, do people still say that? Is it just me? Easy peasy. All right, anyway. <laughs> Another feature that helps boost productivity is the ability to scan any of those baked in images and pull editable text right out of it. Now, when I say baked in image, I mean a JPEG file, a PNG file. You can actually import the file directly into Google Lens. Then Google will scan that file, pull the text out. Any text that you digitize with Google Lens can be copied and pasted to any Chrome browser that you're signed into. Look at all these birds. Okay, I'm gonna continue exploring this park. Google Lens is also an awesome way to create calendar events really quickly if that event was printed on a piece of paper. This also works for business cards business cards and physical event invitations are almost outdated now. Who's sending a physical invitation? Probably just better to send an email or use our company, dub.com, to send a video message via email or LinkedIn. A quick video definitely, I'd say, is a better way to invite someone to an event, especially if you're using Dub. And with Dub, you can easily add an RSVP or a calendar booking. But who's sending physical calendar invites? I guess it's like a vintage thing, you know? You wanna send that old school invite. Same thing for business cards. All that data on that business card can be easily digitized with Google Lens. This also works with navigating to websites. If there's any link you see anywhere in the physical world, you can scan that in. And barcodes. I'm not usually scanning a lot of barcodes or needing to learn about product, but I imagine there's industries where it'd be useful to you. You can scan a barcode and easily see the different prices on the internet for that product. Just a valuable piece of data that you could have. If it's relevant to your industry, then that could be very useful. You can also translate text with Google Lens. Almost any language that you don't understand, you see it in the real world, just hold up Google Lens and it'll translate that into your language. We're living in the future. We're living in the future. I think Google Lens is an underutilized tool. If you want to stay up to date with business tips and growth strategies, consider subscribing to this channel, The Daily Dub. Subscriptions show us that you like this video and you want to see more. And if you're already subscribed, just leave us a like or a comment down below with any questions and we'll get back to you. So thank you so much for watching this video. Catch you next time. Farewell.